Homeland Security level for Modern Warfare 2, Spec Ops, veteran difficulty. Uh, got the picture in picture thing going. Living in America. <laughs> the boss. <laughs> so the plan here is there's five waves of guys. We're on veteran difficulty. Um, and what we're doing right now is we're running to the top of this building and just getting on the top of this building, holding off the first wave of guys and killing all but one of the final guys. Okay. And the reason we're doing this is because there is a turret on the roof of this building. And after we kill all but one of the guys, we are going to, or uh, my co-op partner, uh, Rebel Inc., is going to pick up that turret, run it back to the beginning of the level. Oh, this is the one you are telling me This about. is the one I was telling you about before. Um, he's, the, <clears throat> the easiest way to just hold off all these guys is just kind of watch that little hatch door that I originally ran up, and he's watching the back door. Um, anyway, so just kill all but one of the guys, grab... Uh, he's gonna grab that turret that's kind of like glowing gold mm -hmm. in my screen right now, and he's gonna run back to the beginning and drop it off in the gas station at the very start of the level. Mm -hmm. And then there is a uh, another turret in the bank that's uh, in the building adjacent to this. Um, burger complex that I'm on right now. Uh -huh. Now you can't stay on top of the roof of this building for the entire thing because in subsequent subsequent waves of guys there are helicopters and UAVs and all sorts of shit that'll kill you from the air mm. and will also take out your turrets really quickly. Oh, the turrets have health. The turrets can get shot up. I see. So, having them be inside the building uh, that I'm going to eventually put them in. That building that I'm looking at right there is where the other turret is. Um, How do you know when you're down to one guy? It says hostiles, no. nine, eight. I see. Door away. Yep, there you go. And actually, unfortunately, um, well, there's going to be a picture on picture, even though we're not watching it as we do the voiceover. But my recording froze for the final wave of guys. Uh -huh. So I'm actually using Rebel Link's screen for the fifth wave. I see. And there won't be picture in picture on that. I see. But anyway, it should be pretty easy to follow nonetheless. And actually, for the last wave of guys, all of our turrets were dead for the hardest wave. Yeah. And we ended up holding everybody off on our own, just normally. Hmm. So it worked out all right. It's not too hard to do. So there's only one guy left now. I'm running into this bank, grabbing the turret, grabbing some claymores if you want. That looks weird. Yeah, it's kind of a goofy animation for when you're <laughs> sprinting with this thing. It looks like, it reminds me of Half-Life. How? Uh, oh, like, like when, when you, when you have the gravity turret, gun? Like you don't see your hand. Uh -huh. and there's like stuff just floating in front of your face. When you have the gravity gun? Or, mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. I mean, that's funny. <laughs> it looks so dumb. Yep. I can't believe this is like the most hottest game right now. Yep. So just drop your turret behind one of those windows and get the other turrets pretty quickly because as soon as you set them down, they're going to kill that 30th guy mm -hmm. or 20th guy from the previous wave. Run out there, grab the other turret. And if you want, set some claymores out the back door just to make it easier. So right now, got this uh, line of killing machines just yeah. mowing people down, which is great. And you can just kind of sit back and relax and so avoid getting... Burger. Yeah. Just have, chill, <laughs> honey bunny. <laughs> <laughs> good, good reference. <clears throat> so this picture-in-picture picture thing has turned out pretty sweet. Yeah, it turned out pretty nice. Um, hopefully it syncs up all right. The... Two of the videos that I did, they turned out great. They synced up perfectly. One of them, there was a little bit of lag in like while we were playing. I mean, Xbox Live. Right. Even though it was peer-to-peer -peer hosting, mm -hmm. and there's only two people playing, there was a little bit of lag. Um, oh, I must have been downloading some sort of adult movie. film. <laughs> um, this third wave is going to have one helicopter, so grab a rocket launcher before it starts up and don't stay outside too long either because there's a predator drone who can uh, just shoot all sorts of missiles at you and take you out pretty quick anyway like I was saying before it, the, uh, two of the previous videos that I did uh, picture in picture for they synced up 
extremely well. Uh, the clocks were, the in-game clock, clock, mm -hmm. clocks were uh, synced through the entire video. Mm -hmm. And then the one with the lag, like he was like four or five seconds behind what my clock said. Hmm. And it was really weird. It was kind of a pain in the ass to sync up, but it worked out all right. So you, I don't think you can take out that Predator drone. Uh, but I was just running around outside looking for... What is a Predator drone? Like a UAV thing floating oh. way up high in the air that just shoots missiles. Oh. Mm. And two of the turrets are down already. You can see the ones that are kind of pointing at the ceiling. Mm -hmm. Those are dead. There might have been a better place to put some of those turrets, but uh, I thought this worked out alright. What's, uh, what's that say beneath hostiles? Uh, BTR-80. Oh, what's that? That is the, um, like a tank, basically. Okay, so there's a tank. There's a tank coming down. And, uh, you know, this is pretty easy just staying in this room here because you can revive your partner when you need to and mm -hmm. do all that easy stuff. But that was the BTR right there, even though I'm... I think I hit him. <clears throat> it's hard to tell. Um, does this game support LAN play? Yes, it does. So if you and I wanted to do this without going over the internet together? I believe we could. I'm not 100% sure. Uh, it also supports split screen. So we'd play so, on one console. Right, and it does it kind of, a, kind of like Resident Evil 5 did, mm -hmm. where it's... It doesn't fill up the entire TV. Mm -hmm. It does two 16 by 9 things kind of staggered. Mm -hmm. And they don't go the entire width. Um, Enemy drone has you. But, over. yeah, so, I don't know, if you want, you can take out some of these guys. They're not... And you know, when you have your partner right next to you waiting to revive you, mm -hmm. it's pretty easy to just um, get a couple shots off and help out the turrets a bit. Jam a tampon in your... Ass. You what? Oh, wound. Frozen tampon popsicles. <laughs> so there's gonna be two helicopters and one BTR. Oh. And I've switched screens, and the colors on his are a little bit different. I think his brightness is just set to a different level. Wow. God, dude, you just got really good all of a sudden. Hey, you take that back. <laughs> what happened? <laughs> That's not nice. You asshole. <laughs> so yeah, like I mentioned before, my recording froze, but... Uh, yeah, just continue to stay in this little coffee shop, burger place. Order the, the soup du jour. That's the soup of the day? Ah. <laughs> it's kind of weird watching the screen, because he just kind of moves around in a much different way than I would ever think. But whatever. You also have a ton of grenades and a bunch of the Semtex, which is like a sticky grenade, oh. which is pretty cool. And you can get sticky kills. Oh, really? Have, have you done that in multi? You probably haven't even unlocked them in multiplayer yet. No, I played the one time. Oh, really? For 20 minutes. Oh. And that was enough. <laughs> I'll waste my free time doing something else. <laughs> something that's fun when you don't just get slaughtered. I'd rather throw in Halo 3. Hmm. Hmm. Right. Cause at least I know how to play that. That's a good point. So, yeah, not a lot else to say in this mission. There's no time limit, so don't uh, don't kill yourself trying to get the last helicopters or the BTR. Um, and be careful <clears throat> with your rocket launcher ammo. You can't just kind of fire it wildly because unless you want to run across the entire level and uh, go to the ammo reloader box mm -hmm. there's not a lot in this area right here so um, choose your shots wisely other than that enjoy the rest of the video Cool.
Everyone, be advised, enemy drone has noticed you. Over. Nice one. Chopper down. Enemy Predator drone has spotted you. Advise taking cover. Over. Enemy drone is firing directly on your position, Hunter. That's the white duck. Nice one. Chopper down.